Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, Crystal's Corner, my little corner of the country. Today, I am bringing you a tag that I was tagged in called Beautiful Christmas Tag, and it is about beauty products. And I was tagged by Rena from Boxes and Deals, and then when I get finished with this at the uh, end, I will put a list of the ladies I am tagging in the description. So go check the description box to see if you have been tagged in this. And then if you want to do it, feel free to do it. If you don't want to do it, don't don't worry about it. And if you um, want to do it and you weren't tagged, then please, by all means, tag yourself and do it. All right, I still have a cold. Sorry, I sound awful, I know. I just can't get over this. Please pray that it goes away quickly because I have a Christmas party to go to tonight. That's why I'm dressed like this. All right. All righty. Now, I'll just tell you straight up front, I love makeup, but I'm not huge into it. So, I mean, I wear it every day. I, I'm the type of person that I wear my makeup if I'm just going to the take the trash out. So, I am a beauty person, but I don't really buy a lot of it so you'll you'll see okay if number question number one if you had to pick one Christmas gift beauty related what would it be I need a new eyeshadow palette so um, I really like uh, Urban Decay naked palettes but any kind of eyeshadow palette would be great I like um, natural colors kind of like what I have on just nudes and things like that nothing too vibrant okay number two if you created an, a Christmas eye look would you use red or green I would probably because I don't use very bright colors on my well I do on my lips but not on my eyes um I would probably do green I would do maybe a, a mossy earthy green something like that um, for a Christmas eye look I and mean, then maybe put some I would do some gold shimmer or something like that on the edges all right number three what new christmas rollout beauty item excites you most and why this would be a question for my daughter because she knows what's coming out and i have no idea um we were at sephora the other day and we saw a really cute eye palette i don't know if it was kat von d or what but i really liked that so i guess maybe that not sure if it was a new rollout product or what um, number four, thinking about Christmas past, is there a favorite beauty item you received? What was it, and do you still have it? Yes, I do. It looks horrible because I use it every day. And you guys, this is old. I'm not sure, five years ago, maybe? Five years ago, six years ago. My daughter, Allie, bought me the first naked palette. Look at this. See, now I usually have, um, uh, foundation on my fingers so my stuff gets really gross <laughs> but yeah I think this is the first one and look I'll show you this is why I need a new palette guys this is all I have left so yeah I need that and yes I do still have it and I use it every day still all these years um, in number five if you had to pick one brand to receive for Christmas what would it be Urban Decay I really like it and the lipstick that me and my daughter bought the other day and I do not know the name brand of it but it was at Sephora I love it love it it's a lip stain um, number six do you change your skincare routine for the winter and do you have any tips or tricks I don't my skincare routine you guys are gonna laugh is so basic and so old-school that you're gonna get a kick out of this. Okay, so in the mornings, I use, ta-da, Noxzema Classic. I love the smell of that. It, oh, it just opens your sinuses. Love it. Um, that's what I use in the mornings. And then for my moisturizer, I use this day and night, the old school Olay Hydrating, Active Hydrating Lotion. So I use this day and night. And then nighttime only, this is kind of crazy, but I use coconut oil and I just put it in here. This is what I take my makeup off with every night. 
it's amazing. It takes everything off. No kidding you. I, waterproof mascara, anything, lip stain, coconut oil. I kid you not, takes it off and works amazing. I just put it in this container and then I just take like my washcloth and I don't know if you can see that and just dip it in there, swipe it. And that's what I use at night. So do I change it up for the winter? No. Um, I might use more coconut oil like after I'm done wiping or washing my makeup off with the coconut oil. Hey Tucker. I always, in the winter time when the skin gets a little more dry, I will put my Olay lotion on and then I'll cover my face with coconut oil. So yes, I guess I do change it up a little bit. I use a little more coconut oil. Okay. Uh, t -t 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 -t. I have to hurry. I have a client coming. Let's see. Number seven. Christmas gatherings. Are you no makeup, everyday makeup, or full glam? I am everyday makeup. I'm everyday makeup all the time. Unless it's like New Year's Eve or something, and then sometimes I'll wear sparkly glitter or something like that. But like tonight, I'm going to a Christmas party. If I felt better, I may go and put some sparkles on or something or some glitter eyeshadow. But um, yeah, typically just everyday makeup is me. Um, nine. Fav number nine. Favorite palette that gets your gets you in the Christmas mood and why my favorite palette all year round is the Naked Palette. All of them. Except for I saw one the other day in Sephora that was some wild colors and mm, I didn't like that one. Me and my daughter were like, what in the world is that? <laughs> I don't know. I don't remember the name. It was Naked Palette. It was one of the new ones. Um, Number nine, favorite Christmas red lipstick for the holidays. I just got this the other day, and it's just a sample from Kat Von D. But look at that red. I think that is a vibrant. It's Kat Von D, and it's called Outlaw. That seems to be a really, really, I need to put that on for tonight, because this pink uh, does not match this red. But yeah, that would be, I think I'm going to switch to that for this evening. I love that. <clears throat> Let's see. Number 10. Where do you shop for beauty items for Christmas? Always, usually Sephora, but now after um, hearing um, uh, Rena on uh, Boxes and Deals, I'm going to try Marshalls and um, uh, TJ Maxx. I'm excited. Uh, and I have seen them before where it's really gross and nasty, but we have a brand new Marshalls in my small town. So I think it would be a good time to go Christmas shopping there. So I, usually Sephora, but I'm going to try Marshall, Marshalls this year. Um, number 11, and this is the last question. If you were going to receive any sub box as a gift, <clears throat> what would it be? I like anything spa related. Um... Let's see, what was one I saw recently? Well, I take that back. I like Calls Box. I like the one um, that um, I saw Vicky Week do the other day. Um, what was it, Vicky? It was the one with the oil, Earth, Earth Box, Earth something. I can't remember you guys I'm sorry I, when I get a cold I can't well I can't remember crap anyway but when I get a cold it's worse um it was the one with the um uh, all those essential oils I love let me breathe my peppermint I love essential oils and I can't do without them there now maybe I can breathe a little better um so yeah anything spa related or any kind Honestly, well, my favorite now is uh, I Love Jewelry and Luxury Diva and, um, uh, God. I like the ones, I don't know a lot of the names of them, but I like the ones that have, like, coffee mugs and blankets and maybe Fab Fit Fun. Um, I'm going to try that this coming year for me and my daughter. And, um, I don't know. If I was going to receive one for a gift anything honestly um that would just be the coolest present i think um to get a three six or 12 month subscription given to you wow that would be that would be i couldn't imagine so i could imagine well i didn't really tell my family 
that. That would be a, that would have been a good idea for a gift. But my husband got me this year, and Allie always gets me the best stuff, so I don't even tell her because she just knows me and she gets me the best presents. Um, but this year I told my husband I wanted a uh, season passes to Dollywood and a trip with him and my daughter. Uh, to Dollywood so we are going in January and he got me season passes and I'm super excited so all right guys I have got to get to work I have a client coming so I'm going to stop my video now check in the description box below and see if you have been tagged and if you have please do the video and I will look forward to seeing yours and also tag me and all the others and that way we can see your video as well all right guys have a blessed day and I'll be back on my next video bye